Hey everyone, it's Sydney. So today I'm going to be telling you why I chose the Dexcom to be my CGM of choice. So for comparison purposes, the other CGMs that I'm going to be comparing it to is the Medtronic Guardian CGM and the Freestyle Libre CGM, um, or Flash Monitoring System is technically what it's called. So with that being said, let's get to it. So the first thing that I'm going to say is the number one reason that I got the Dexcom is because my endocrinologist, and also from what I've heard, has says that it is the most accurate CGM. So because I wanted a CGM to obviously be as close to my actual blood glucose reading as possible, I decided to go with that one. So it's kind of a given um, from what I've heard, and then also with my endocrinologist basically confirming it, that it was the most accurate, and of course that's what I'm looking for. Now the next reason that I decided to pick the Dexcom instead of any other CGM is the appearance of it. Now this one I realize overall doesn't affect the use of it. I just generally prefer the look of the Dexcom sensor over the look of the Guardian. Um, and then as far as the freestyle, um, that one I didn't have a problem with, but there's another reason that I picked a Dexcom that didn't take that into play. Now the third reason that I decided to pick a Dexcom is kind of more of the like popularity thing um, and the sense is that the more people have it, the more you're going to trust it. From everyone that I know that has a CGM, only one of them has a Libre. Um, the rest of them all have Dexcoms. Since more people have that one, I generally lean to trust it more. Now the fourth reason that I decided to pick a Dexcom is the fact that it gives me alerts. Um, so this one is mostly leaning against the Freestyle Libre as opposed to the Guardian because the Guardian does this as well. Um, I wanted it to be able to alert me when I'm about to get low or alert me when I'm going too high or wake me up in the middle of the night if I'm going too high or too low so I don't wake up really low or wake up really high as I would if I didn't have um, a CGM. Since the Libre is more of a flash monitoring system, it only gives you readings or your trend graph when you actually swipe it. You still don't get an alert. But I hope that the deciding factors for me maybe help you make the decision on what CGM you want if you're looking. Obviously I'm only including things that are big differences between the two. As far as whether or not you want a CGM in general, that's a whole separate video on its own. But thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, then make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified when I upload. But that is all for today and I hope to see you next time. Bye guys.